Hey everyone, so today I thought I would talk to you about black soldier fly larvae. Um, they're high in protein and they have a bunch of essential, essential minerals. And they've also got calcium for strong eggshells because the, um, the shell of the body on the, the flies is intact. So when the chickens eat them as a treat, they get the shell and everything. So it's, it's a great source of calcium for them. And it's a great treat if you don't let your chickens free range like I don't. So I tend to throw down protein treats um, for them so that they still get their protein. So that because they don't free range, they're not running around the yard grabbing bugs and insects and that kind of thing. So I go ahead and give them protein treats to make up for that. Now the black soldier flies, you can breed them if you want. They consume organic waste, so it works great with composting um, because they will help to compost your leftover fruits and vegetables like in, in a normal compost pile. So they're a good organism to work with your composting program. Um, I don't have enough room um, where I've got my compost set up to, to get into breeding them myself, so I buy them. And that just seems easier, um, an easier way for me. And a lot of people don't want to get into the breeding program, so that's okay. You can buy them already done. And so let me show you what I've got, and then I'll show you how much the hens like them. So now that I've flipped the camera around, um, this is the product that I purchased. It's called Grubbly's. Um, it's out of Georgia and you can buy smaller like one pound packs or you can buy the um, the five pound I had the smaller packs to make sure the girls liked it But now that I know they do it's more economical to get the five pound and they have a replacement bag that fits in this big plastic tub So let me show you what they're like So This is what the um black soldier fly larva looks like and I'll grab some for you so it's there um they kind of look like I can't find it in the camera sorry here I'll hold one up so they kind of look like an insect like a larva would and they they don't feel slimy or anything they actually um they're very dry, um, so they feel similar to the mealworms, you know, as far as you touching them and grabbing them. They smell pretty good, actually. I don't mind the smell at all. So let's go outside here. The girls know the tub, so you're going to see them start to gather around. So let's come out here because I don't feed them inside the coop. And let me put the tub down. They know something's up. So let me see if I can't get you in the light. It's a little dark, but I hope you can see. So hold on and I'll toss some out for them. And they love these so you can see they they really like getting treats like this so typically what I do is I just scatter them all around out here so that the different little clicky groups of ladies don't fight too much so I tend to just throw them everywhere so that they can go ahead and have plenty of room to stay away from each other and still get their treats. So that's my tip for you today is black soldier fly larva. Um, it is a great protein treat for your flock and you can either um, grow them yourself or you can go ahead and just buy them already done and use them similar to the way you would mealworms. So um, that's what I've got for you today. So until next time, um, find some great um, grublies or um, black fly larva treats for your girls and try it out.